Okay, let me, let me ask you this question. Uh, uh, it, it gained currency when you resigned, that you were afraid of Juju. That was why you left the national team. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I, yeah. So then you talked about you did talk about your medical condition, but please, I, 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 I just want to hear directly from you. Was it because of Juju you left the national team? Was it, that was why you resigned? I, I you did uh, no mass and not do again. Was it because was it because of that? My brother, I played Super Eagles for ten years though. <laughs> so if not, if if I don't have you under myself when it comes to Juju, I'm not just saying, then, then I don't know why I played Super Eagles. <laughs> so what, what really happened? You talked about time, moms, yeah. Look, when, what happened was, when I was coaching Nigeria, I caught the virus called mumps. Okay. It is a bit, when you're an adult and you catch it, it's a bit like what corona does now. Because it affects your immunity. It gives you a swell here and then it, all, it, it can even make you sterilized. It affects your inner ear, it affects your eyes, your nose and everything. I was struggling so bad. I lost weight. I was falling sick. I had to come to Germany. For them to even discover I have books, I had to go to Munich to get treated. It cost me 11,300 euros to cure myself from months. And as at that time, it was that bad. If you, if you check the picture, you see how I lost weight. Especially if you look at the picture, a chant. You saw how lean I was. I was suffering so much, and the, coach, the doctors all in Europe said to me, I shouldn't travel anymore, I shouldn't go to Africa. But I was coach of the Super Eagle. And I wanted to serve my country. So I said, no, I would do it. So they were giving me infusions of vitamin C. If you ask the doctor of Super Eagles, when we played uh, in Swaziland for the uh, World Cup qualifiers to 2018, he came into my room three hours to the game to give me a drip of vitamin C. That was how bad it was. But Nigerians didn't know about that. And I was doing all this because I wanted my country to go to the World Cup. And I wanted to help the players because I believe I have the quality, so pass it on. But the doctors also told me you have to keep distance from people because your immunity is so low, you cannot affect, you cannot afford another infection. When I came, I explained it to everybody. I listen, guys, when it comes to handshakes, hugging, and you know, even drinking from water and things like that, or from cups, I have to be careful because even if I catch not just small bacteria, it will get worse. Oh, it appeared juju. That is why. Now, <laughs> coronavirus is here now. It is the same thing. People should not shake hands. People should not do this. That was how it is. Um, I resigned from the Super Eagles because I decided when I was sick, I was going to stop. Because I didn't get any help from the Federation. In fact, today, I didn't get one cobble from that 11300 I spent. And I told them about the fees. Nobody, nobody tried to help me with support. But the, I, have, I was bringing up some boys to go to China. They were home-based players. I had formed them, they were playing some wonderful football, possession football, aggressive football, aggressive football. So, and the boys, I made an agreement with them that, listen, I will take you to Chan and I will help you to sell yourself. Most of those boys today are not professionals. I took them to Chan and we lost the last game because the boys didn't even want to play because they were not paid. They were not given anything. So it is, it, and then that was it. But when the tournament was over, I felt that, Accomplished my part with this group of players are making the world. I resigned. And then they started, oh, it's because of this, because of that. Why can you tell me you love Nigeria more than me? I've almost, I've come out of almost on a, on a dying bed to, to help Nigeria uh, get to the World Cup, uh, to the Nations Cup final in 2000. Yeah. You know, I've spent my own money to, uh, to finance Super Eagles on several occasions. So how can somebody come out and say, he resigned because of this? If you love Nigeria so much, show me what you have done for Nigeria, not what you have taken from Nigeria. <laughs> that that is the thing. But the thing is, when you when you when you are somebody like me, that is, I am principled. I am not ashamed to say about it. If I like something, I do it. If I don't like it, I stay away from it. And the principle has kept me, got me this far, and I will continue to be like that. But at the same time, also, I also respect people because God blessed us differently, in different ways. But the only thing I ask of is that look. Let's love our own because you cannot kick out your own child and adopt the neighbor's child. It doesn't work like that. It doesn't, it doesn't work that way.